What's going on YouTube? It's your buddy Will at the What's Up in the Sky 37 channel or online at www.whatsupinthesky.com And have you been told about the water on Mars? If you're one of my subscribers, you have been told about it and you've seen it firsthand. But if not, this might become as a shock to you because I'm sure back in school or, you know, if you're back, if you're still in school, if you're young and you're looking at this, you were told that Mars is a red barren planet and we're just happening to find 2% water in in the place we're digging with Curiosity Rover. Well, let me tell you here that it's not the truth that uh, we found standing water on Mars, and we found it a long time ago. This is from the... Let me take a quick look here for you. show you that I did not take this here. It's from Earth. This is from the Marble Global, Sur Global Surveyor. You can find this in the description link. All my pictures or all my videos have description. Um, you check it out. There's a link to the picture down there. You'll always find it online. I don't, you know, I don't Photoshop anything. You know, I leave it as it is. And if I do Photoshop it, I do it while I'm doing the video. So uh, there's plenty more of these. If you go back and look for, if you want to see more stuff like this, and just just so you can see, there's a lot more water out there. Um, go for it. Check out my other videos. Hit my website up. You can get them that way. But uh, just take a look at this here real fast. Look at the shorelines around here. It's very interesting. It even has like the darker vegetation. You can see under. See how even here, like when you're looking at water it just goes deeper in certain areas and it smooths out it looks like there's rockier shores now if this isn't water I, I'm not saying this is definitely water but I'm pretty much saying it's water <laughs> you know it could be anything it could be any type of liquid but it's it's unfrozen flowing liquid um, to the fact where you can see the shorelines on it now earlier I just made this video once and it didn't record so I, I pulled up Google Earth here let me just pull it up and just randomly went up to the Great Lakes region here I'll show you what I did just bam just pulled right into this and just found a couple lakes to say hey you know what do lakes look like on Earth and I've done this in other Google videos with uh, JP JP Skipper has uh, the Mars Anomaly research website he does a lot of these and uh, he's put up these same images they look the exact same to where look at this even you see in the uh, middle where it gets the islands start coming up or it gets deeper, it gets, you know, of course, the water here and on, especially up this high at, at this level, is uh, surely no, uh, it surely does not look like this. It's not as pristine and as beautiful as what we got here, but um, you can see the darkness and see how it even comes up in the middle, like the land comes through it. Uh, what seem to be bushes and stuff like here around it, and look how bright it is. Like, look how the, you can see the water just reflecting off the sun, and what seem to be even maybe some, uh, you know, this here seems to be a mountain or something up in the air a little bit with some more uh, areas around it. So, I mean, this isn't the best resolution, these pictures, but I tell you what, there's a reason they're not at their best resolution. The uh, this gar the Mars Global Surveyor had much better pictures than uh, sizes in this. This is only 0 0.03 megabytes for the resolution, so it's very, very cheesy resolution, but I think most people can agree that that's a standing liquid. Whether it's water or not, we're never going to know because we're never going to be told. I really hope that India's mission makes it there. Maybe we'll get some truth out of India, um, but the reason we're not going to tell us about prior life on that because it doesn't fit our current paradigm you know and if stuff doesn't fit the current paradigm it gets pushed away just like if you look anything at Jonathan Gray's ancient I really respect him and his ancient uh, um, what is it the forbidden tales a forbidden forbidden archaeology basically you know things that they find that don't fit the paradigm of the what's normal in science they just toss out you know put it aside hidden for all time and these pictures uh, we're lucky they're even there for us to see you know so somebody up there wants us to know that there's more than just uh, you know sand and dirt on Mars they're slowly telling us but how come they just don't come out and say wow it looks like we found some big ass lakes of water up there I don't know somebody NASA I know you guys watch the videos I see your servers hit it all the time why don't somebody reply let us know what this is so much love guys take it easy what's up in the sky 37 as always check the description I got links to my, all my pages I got links to this picture right here and uh, like I said you'll always find that in my stuff hit like hit comment let us know what you think much love peace